may we realize that we have the power of God guiding us, leading us, helping us moment by moment. Isaiah 40, verse 4. Every valley shall be lifted up. Every mountain and hill be made low. The uneven ground will become level, and the rough places a plain. May God make in your life every low point of your life lifted up. And may God make every barrier in your life be made low, and may the uneven areas of your life, the ups and downs, the unsuredness, become a level playing field. May the rough places in your home, in your family, in your work, may they be made soothing and ever increasing in their power to bless you. I pray that you live and you move and you have your being in God. And in this knowledge that you ask God for God's guidance first in everything you do. I pray in prayer that you listen within, in the stillness, for instruction directly from God, and you receive it. I pray that every action is guided by God, and every action and reaction is guided by God's love. I pray that you live in absolute trust of God, that you are able to turn every situation over to God's care, and in that trust and faith, you know that God's love shines on every step that you take. I decree in Jesus Christ's name that the darkness is gone. I pray that the barriers are gone. I pray that you are able to take one step at a time on the pathway of abundant living and that you feel a sense of knowingness that God is going ahead of you and that God is empowering you to take every step you take. The love of God enfolds you. The light of God shines for you, showing you the way to spiritual living. And as you know this for yourself, your heart is filled with faith. Your heart is filled with trust. The joy of God's love is with you always. And you are able to think clearly as you receive the guidance of God in how to think. You're able to act wisely as you receive the guidance of God in the ways that you are to go. I pray in this moment of time that you are preparing to have a day of listening for the direction of God and that that direction comes and it is clearly understood and acted upon. In Jesus Christ's name, amen.